Hi folks, Jeff from Orange Acres Cars. Uh, beautiful Jocko Valley here. The lovely town of Shalai, which we're between Missoula and Arley. Uh, up past Evero Hill, just a little ways. And today I'm going to show you this Ford Taurus. And this is a Taurus sedan. And uh, as far as we know, this is a salvage title. Now what's that mean? some point in time it was wrecked and it was repaired. But be honest with you, I can't tell where it was hit at. But maybe we'll walk around it and we'll see if we can look for any signs of any repaint. You can see there's a little paint right here. So you can tell that it was painted maybe right in this corner. I don't know if they painted the whole car. They painted just part of it, but it is in good shape. It was probably a long time ago and it's been running ever since and driving ever since, you know. So, hey, I, I can't tell you what was done. It's got a vent shade on this door. It doesn't have one on that door. Maybe it's just got ones in the front. Let's go take a look here. Yep, it's got just got vent shades on the front two doors. Don't know why it doesn't have ones on the back two doors, but it used to have them. Must have came off. Let's take a look inside. It's super low miles. It's got 99k on it. It's pretty low miles. It's got it's a 1997 Katy Perry on the stereo. Nope. All right. Uh, uh, you got uh, AC. Blows cold. You got power windows. We got two power windows. Uh oh. We got three power windows. Rear passenger window does not work. See, it's real clean inside. Let's try that rear one for back here. And uh, we're gonna pop the hood. Odometer says 99.137. She's got the door open indicator light on. Other than that, there's no check engine lights or anything like that. So no lights on it. It's uh, good to go. And uh, you can see it's got a beautiful windshield on it. Good windshield. Let's take a look around. Got a nice big trunk on it. Look at them tires in the back are 50%. We'll check the ones on the front here. 50% on the tire here. It's got the alloy wheels. That tire's a little low. I'll have to get some air on that for your test drive. It might just be where it's sitting. The tires are better than 50% on the front. So, obviously somebody replaced the tires in the front, moved into the back. That's generally how they do it. Put the new ones on the front. So you barely wear any bad ones in the back. There's a 3.0 V6 in here. And uh, it's got a super start battery. Super start. You can see in the front here. Now, th this, is, this is something that you look for, okay? I don't want to buy a salvage car, it's really in really bad shape. Okay, this is what we're going to look for. Inner fender wells right here. These are inner fender wells. They're, they look to be in pristine shape. The outer fenders can be replaced. If you have a car that's in a massive front end collision, it could damage like the alignment and that kind of stuff. But it would you, people would just take off the fenders and put new fenders on, but usually you see a lot of wrinkles in those inner fender wells. And from what I can tell on these inner fender wells, that it's very very clean they're not they're not damaged so more than likely what happened was it either got sideswiped maybe a door was replaced maybe this back end corner was done you know uh, if you hit a car in the back end it, you got to bond to all these these parts don't come off and you could, you could feel a little bit of solid in there and so maybe what happened was it was hit in the back end but that shouldn't affect how it drives you know usually they drive real straight if a car was ran into a wall in the front, then you'd have airbag damage and all that kind of stuff. And this car has got all the airbags, no airbag lights on, that drives great. So, you want to come take a look at it, let us know. 370-5466. Jeff from Orange Acres Cars. Uh, and uh, the number, uh, check out all our other cars uh, at orangemt.com. And uh, for current prices. And check out all our other cars. 40 cars under $49.95. Thanks for tuning in. We're at mile marker 13 on Highway 93 North. There's our Lee down there. So south of our Lee, 13 miles north of Missoula.